The Grand Rapids Downtown Development Authority will give us an update tomorrow on a major project to reconfigure the Grand River. 24 Hour News 8, Sarah Hurwitz is live in Grand Rapids to see the progress being made on this development and how fishermen feel about the new plans. Sarah? Well, Brian and Marley, right now, Grand Rapids Whitewater, the nonprofit that is leading the project, is currently navigating the permit process with a number of agencies. And this project is really focused on reconfiguring the 6th Street Dam right here, which is a hook for some fishermen. They cast a line about once a week. They jump up the dam, obviously, and then they go around the, the smaller part of the fish ladder. Mm -hmm. But they also school up here because they can, obviously they have to get up the dam. So that's why you have so many people fishing here rather than upstream. It's the perfect spot at the 6th Street Dam. But sometimes for fishermen Austin Baggy and Bishop Arp, it can get crowded. Completely shoulder to shoulder, like, like completely packed in. That's not a safe place for fishermen to be because it gets real crowded in there. And as they get closer to the dam, it, it's pretty dangerous in there. The revitalization and restoration project Grand Rapids Whitewater President Richard Bishop says would change that. What we've got to do as a part of the process is uh, take out the four beautification dams that are in the downtown area and then lower or take out the 6th Street Dam. The 6th Street Dam would be replaced with an adjustable structure dam between Ann and Leonard Streets. He says the current dam acts as a barrier from sea lamprey and invasive species from getting upstream. Its replacement would continue that while helping the river restore to its natural rapid flow and enhance the habitat for wildlife. What we've seen already is the, this catalytic impact of this idea of once again turning and facing the river. Grand Rapids Assistant Planning Director Jay Steffen says this project Project is in line with the pulse of the city right now, drawing people back to the river, like these two who are casting their line in favor of the change. I think potentially it could uh, create more space, like you said, for uh, us fishermen and uh, for the fish. You know, these fish are bigger, you know, they like their space. And 30% of the funds of this $44 million project have already been raised and uh, Whitewater will be presenting a continued details of this project tomorrow morning to the DDA. That's at 8 o'clock. Live in Grand Rapids, Sarah Hurwitz, 24-Hour News 8.